Hello, it's uh, Jonathan Blowers here again. Um, we've been talking about passive house and the principles of it. We're now coming to the next one, and that is air. Um, what we need to do to be able to control environment. We spoke about the air tightness and how we need to uh, give a ventilation uh, within that environment. And we use what we call an MVHR, Mechanical Ventilation Heat Recovery System. Um, here, in one of the, we're just in one of our workshops at the moment. We don't have one here, but I'll do my best to explain it. It's very simple. The simple movement of air and how we can extract the maximum amount of energy out of that as it passes through. Basically, it's an insulated box. We have a box. Within that box, we have two motors. Those two motors are pulling air in from outside and pulling air from the inside out. <clears throat> so basically what that does is it brings air from the outside, brings it in, goes through a filter. It filters out pollen, impurities, anything we don't want in the air is filtered out. And it goes through the most important piece to the center, the heat exchanger. We'll go through that in a second. And then that air passes through and goes into the building. The other motor brings the air from the inside, cross through the heat exchanger, and exits or exhausts through to the outside of the house. So we've got a crossover of air and a continuous flow. Um, both filtered in both directions, because from the house we want to take dust, damp, everything that's in the house outside, but we don't want to pass it through the heat exchanger. So therefore we have two filters, two motors, one heat exchanger, and that is basically it. So what actually happens is as it comes in, filtered, the heat exchanger, this is the important part. Technology in this has improved so much in recent years. Um, we've gone from about 60% efficient up to about 92% efficient. So therefore we're reusing potentially 90, 92% of any heat that's in the house already and recycling that in filtered fresh air. Now the heat exchanger is a very um, important but a simple product really, it's a simple way of doing it. If you can imagine straws crossing, and there's lots and lots of those very close together, very small, and you've got two separate air flows. One doesn't touch the other, it just passes. Now what happens in nature is it wants to ameliorate, it wants to be an average. If there's 20 there and zero there, it wants to be 10 in the middle. So we use that to our advantage. It's a natural process where we're drawing the heat or the energy from one source and putting it into the other. So we are exchanging the heat without actually mixing the air. There we get a controlled environment which zero dust, zero pollen, um, we can get rid of humidity and everything in there is very little damp and it creates a really healthy environment to live in where you don't get molds, you don't get all the horrible stuff you get in traditional builds. Um, and the more efficient the machine and the better the air tightness, the better the quality and the easier it is to control within our living space. So MVHR, Mechanical Ventilation Heat Recovery.